We will not bow down to a racism. We will not bow down to injustice. We will not bow down to exploitation. I'm gonna Jackson. Um, this mural that I'm working on, I've been struggling with the name all week. I knew about the project, uh, Sade Adams along with Gogi and um, Johnson C. Smith University uh, okayed commissioned this project to happen through a grant through Duke Energy and I'm honored to be the artist chosen to do it. What do I have to say about it? Well currently it's a work in progress. It'll be finished by Friday for sure. And right now I'm working on Whoopi Goldberg. The thing for me is um, it's very important that this class, this generation, as well as freshman classes to come will look upon this and draw not only inspiration, but will almost feel protected. That's the theory behind that, that these women, um, alive or dead, serve as mentors serve as um, almost like angels to watch out over them. That's how I feel when I when felt when I've been working on it. And it's been a blast, you know, some days, you know, we danced, we laughed, we joked, we ate um, bad Chinese food. But at the end, um, every day, the work progressed more and more and more. There's of course artwork on one side leading up to the fourth floor and the other side as well. It's a pretty big project but it's one that I think um, the impact will not be felt until years down the road, what this may possibly mean to young women who, before they start off on their way to classes, you know, can get that little extra kick, that little extra inspiration, that extra reminder that they can um, be anything they want. And that's what I'm looking for. Hi, I'm Shani Adams. I'm from Demopolis, Alabama, small town. I'm Ms. Myers of Myers Hall. It was my idea to bring in the mural with Ms. Lena. She is so amazing. She thinks of ideas on the spot. Um, I kind of help with everything, all the quotes on the stairs, all the pictures that you see in the lobby, and hopefully you'll see more. Thanks. Um, this mural is a big inspiration to Myers Hall, I think, because it gives it a kind of a new light, I guess, a new shine on Myers. Yeah. So I helped in the hallway, on the stairway. Um, I'm called her outliner. I outline with the black marker, like somewhat like this. And sometimes I'd be scared I'm going to mess up, but I have courage in myself. And she motivates me, so I was happy to do it. This mural has been a great, huge, addition to the Myers Hall family. As secretary, I've seen us, the council grow as well as the residents grow as a family and become closer to one another throughout the, the making of this mural. But it also shows us wonderful women throughout history, not just African Americans, that made a positive difference in their community. And it also shows us that we can make a difference in our community. And also one thing to note that um, I learned, I learned that painting was very therapeutic. Um, I do love painting, but it was just a hobby. But seeing, enjoying it with Miss Lena and my Myers family, I learned that it can be more than just painting. It's actually a fun activity, and it brought us closer together. This is my, I'm Wanda Middleton. Um, I'm the residence hall coordinator for Myers Hall, and um, this is the first of its kind to 
ever have this happen in one of the residence halls here on campus. And I am just blessed to be a part of this project that was uh, a, a great effort on part of a grant that was given to us. And also uh, the artist who is responsible for uh, designing the murals that we're, we're now having here on the walls. Here I am on the last day of the mural project at Johnson C. Smith University and um, it's been an adventure for these four weeks that I've been painting, cutting, pasting, and putting together this project known as Tapestry. Tapestry is the name I finally decided on. I thought it was a great double metaphor because it not only expressed, um, or it showcases rather, the actual material that I've glued, um, cut and pasted um, to adorn the women on the wall, but also it represents um, what a tapestry is when you think of the definition of how all the threads connect to make one whole cohesive piece. That's the way I see these women. Otherwise, how else would you connect an Oprah Winfrey to a Frida Kahlo, uh, to a Madam C.J. Walker? Um, we're all women, and um, I believe we have more similarities than we have dissimilarities. So that's when I decided to name it Tapestry, um, to uh, speak on the ties, the threads that bind us all together. I have to say it's kind of bittersweet. Um, I have come to really care about the young women that I'm working with here at Smith, um, including the dorm mother, the RHC, um, Miss Millie, um, security guards, um, uh, uh, other workers on campus, um, it, there really is a family feel to the whole thing. So um, it's with a little bit of regret that I sincerely say um, uh, I'm going to miss working on it. it it's, it's been, like I said, an adventure, but um, uh, the journey has to end here. And I'll have a beautiful mural in place. <laughs> I'm gonna